where you got the artist formerly known as Mistake, now known as a, is it Tamin? Yeah, it's Tamin. Okay. Oh, I mean, I, I, I mean, I'm rooting for my, I'm rooting for my gas money, baby. Okay. Well, let's go gas money. Either way, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, game number one, Battlefield is the play. So we'll see how this works out here. So I think Bayo, you know, obviously in Smash Four, fundamentally kind of struggled against characters like, you know, uh, like Marth and Cloud, characters with, uh, <laughs> with, with swords. So we'll see how it works out here. But I think the big problem that's gonna hit. Uh, that's gonna hit Krom here is that uh, his recovery is still really bad, and Bayo's really good at edge guarding characters with bad recoveries. And again, putting in the work with that uh, heel slide, not gonna roof him, but it's gonna provide a lot of damage. Yeah, although, oh, might be. Okay, ooh, ooh the magnet hands. Yo, oh, shots. shoot him up. Shot. And that's the thing about that is that although a lot of the actual. 100% kill setups and all that stuff have been destroyed from Bayonetta. She still has one of the best edge guarding uh, tools in the entirety of the game. Yeah, man. Both with Witch Twist, you know, away from the ledge and as well as stuff like, uh, you know, like you saw the, the bullet arts right there. But yeah, she'll box you up, man. That's facts. I'm just saying. Man. Oh, okay, you have to you have you have to respect both hits of the down air. Most people just try to block the first one and things are good. No, there is a when she lands, there is another hitbox that comes out and you have to respect Ooh. it. See James going for the up smash on the platform. Gonna come up empty, and that's gonna be death right there. So, a huge lead right, lead right now for Tamim. Let's see if he's gonna be able to, uh, you know, put James away quietly, or if uh, he's gonna come roaring back. Okay, flipping that roll on stage with the back air. Which twist again? You have to respect that. that ooh, was that down tilt? That looked down. That was forward tilt. Oh, forward tilt. Okay. It clips that low? Yeah. Forward tilt. Forward tilt's dumb. Man. I did not know that. Undiscovered planet. That move borked. I did not know. That, that clip that low. That's crazy, man. Okay. All right, so James continuing to play chase right now. Oh, Lord! Shots, watch, your, watch your skittle! Jeez, man, that does so much shield damage. Yeah, it's insane. Still a whole stock here up for Tamim. Gonna get anti-aired. Is Shoyo James gonna take a lot of damage? Oh my god, is that 40 or something? Yeah, man. Yeah, Bayo might not be able to like kill you instantly, but she still does a, has a crazy damage output. Oh, and the up smash through the platform connects. And there we go. Shoyo James uh, going to fall first game to EMG to me. So good job there from him. And again, like, uh, you know, that unfortunate SD in the second stock didn't really do him any favors. So we'll see if, uh, you know, things work out differently here for him. Oh, is James going to change his, uh, his controls maybe? Do you have a control switch? Yeah, delete. Oh, not Squirk, man. Hey, he's out of the tournament, Yo, man. He, no, he didn't deserve that. He's out of the tournament. Yo, Squirk, get body. Squirk deserved better. He's out of the tournament. Get oh, him out. no. No, he's doing it. Oh, no. He's going to do it. Lord, I didn't think I'd see the day. What, what's happening? So he's changing his tag to Gons, which is alluding to every, uh -oh. to New Jersey oh, uh, natives. No. I know what that is. And, uh, and I know what that means. Everybody's homeboy. Everybody's favorite, Simon Belmont main, but also plays Ness when he swore he wouldn't play Ness. The Great Gonzalez. Not great. Which means that is Shoyo James gonna take off the cloak and sword and put on a backpack? Oh. He will! Takes <laughs> off the cloak and sword, puts on the backpack and bat, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Let's go. It is time. Game number two, the Ness counter pick. We'll see if it's actually gonna pan out here. We're actually on Smash Bros, which I think this stage is insane for Ness in my opinion. Yeah, it's not gonna be as as, as insane because you don't have the taxi platform transitioning yeah. across either side of the stage, but nonetheless, uh, you know, still a really good stage here for Ness. You know, tight quarters always do this character really well. And yeah, this is uh, <laughs> this is James trying something. I don't, I, like I said, he's been playing this, this Ness and James is one of those people that he can kind of play any character and it works out for him. But uh, we'll, we'll see about that. Right now, to me, Getting inside right now. Ooh, okay. okay. Confirms off the PK Thunder too. Or PK Thunder, excuse me. Ah! <laughs> nah, we're good. We're Gucci. We're Gucci. You can't do that coast to coast. Go. All right, these air dodges are awful. He's definitely air dodging like a Ness main. Good tech right there for James. And, uh, you know, able to find a respite back on the ground. Good uh, forward tilt right there. Gets okay. the down smash. Ooh, gets a drag down uh, up air, but not gonna get a follow-up out of it. Ooh, there you go, the neutral, neutral air. The new chat of shield. 
So, all right, so, so so that's stock one going to James. Yo, all, all, yo, all the all, all the New York people and the Jersey people are getting hyped right they're, now. They're just like, yo, Shoyo Gonzalez? All the goons right now. <laughs> the goons are out, yo. Okay, I'll be at back air, air to air. Get him out off the right side. Get Damn him man. out. All right, so James already doing miles better than he did in the last game. You know, he's at least not getting you know, three stock for one right now. Finds his way back on the ground, though. And uh, to me, just continuing to add on to this pressure. Not going to roof him, but again, he's doing a lot of damage right now. Okay. He's going to try to elevator going up. No, nah, he's going to miss it. 108, though. He's going to try to commit to that forward smash. Good stuff. Yeah, trying to get these neutralers out of shields, but uh, unfortunately, just not uh, in the range for that to work. Good use of the short jump right there. Punish, no punish on the downer on the platform. Gets the back throw. Air dodges back to the ledge. Okay. Yeah, the heel slide gonna pop him up, but gonna be out of range for that. Well, that was sick. Yeah, that was kind of hype. There's a lot of hopping around. Gets the back throw. Not gonna provide any sort of damage. <laughs> Ooh, again, a lot of camping with back airs right now. James at least keeping it within the wheelhouse. There we go. That is gonna kill. So, Tamim goes up. Uh, one more stock here. Okay, up there. Ooh. A little bit too late on that. He wasn't able to act immediately after hitting that PK Thunder. The Witch Twist. Oh, Lord. Oh, excuse me, the Witch Time. I thought he was going to go into a Witch Twist. Instead back of throw. Out, kick the, the back throw will be enough. Here he goes. So let's see if James can pull one uh, you know, out here with some secondary nests or if Tamim is going to uh, you know, win this game here. Again, the Witch Twist combo, gonna provide a lot of damage, but just not gonna have that same explosive power that they did in the past. I'm just so enthralled with the Ness play here. This neutral's pretty good. Not expecting this out of Shoyo James, to be honest. Yeah, I mean, look, man, I wasn't expecting Ness, period, so I'm just like, whatever. Tamim doing an amazing job here. He does have a one game advantage here. Going for the PK Thunder. Gonna get bat within here. Is oh, that up there? Oh, Dark City off the right side. Forward smash gonna clip. Show yo, James. And he is up, and now to meme up 2 0 here. Somewhere the great Gonzalez is rolling in his bed and crying. Because um, that was not the performance I'm sure he was expecting. So, game number three, guys. We are in the best of five situations here. And it's really important that the adaptation. He's actually going to stick with Ness. Okay. I, I mean, I don't blame him, okay. man. That, that didn't go terrible for him. Come but late. Like, at the same time, I don't think James really has that, you know, that equalizer character that yeah. uh, that counters Krom yet. I mean, he he said that he hasn't really been feeling Diddy Kong, a character that kind of got him on the map that he needed, uh, you know, in Smash 4. But nonetheless, let's see if Ness is work, works out here for him. Going for the movement here. And in space up with PK fires. The short hops, Bayonetta, obviously going to be a character that's going to be abusing the short hop. Yeah. Throw an aerial forward air as well for spacing. Yeah, and I do feel like Bayo is one of the characters that probably counters the PK fire the best just because she has a great aerial approach uh, over it. And obviously she can witch time. Ooh, the double roll going to sneak past that forward smash. There we go. Great witch twist to the back right there from Tamim. Again, providing such awesome pressure right now. Oh, shoot him up, baby. There you go. Picks the high angle back to the ledge and a down Whoa. smash. Walks the dog and the dog bites Tito. That's going to send him. That, and that angle is so good. That the, that angle is OD when he hits you with the down smash at the ledge. It's straight left. Dude, as someone that hails from the land of, uh, like, you know, New Jersey might as well be, you know, Eagle Town. Uh, not fun. Ooh, not going to get a punch on that air dodge, though. Trying to shoot him up right now. Goes for the PK Thunder back to the stage. Oh, but the back yes. air finds its mark, so to me, evening things up now. Beautiful. Beautiful air to air. Okay, we're gonna clip him right now. <laughs> what the hell back is that? Back air. There we go. Great heel slide uh, to the forward air. And a great combo coming up from Tamim right now. PK Thunder gonna get punched with the, after, the down afterburner kick. Yeah, James is trying to find rest for right now. There we go. The forward smash from Tamim. Finds its mark, and now finds himself up here in the clinching game. Oh, wow, that lasted, <laughs> lasted 85 years. That was crazy. That was the longest PK Thunder I've ever seen yeah, in my I'm life. Yeah, I'm saying, bro. though. 
Okay, trying to witch time his way out of the PK Thunder to avoid, or PK Fire, excuse me, to avoid getting grabbed right there. He is at 123, so now we're in the danger zone of the classic, the Ness back throw. El Clasico. Yeah, man. Oh, wow. The air, uh, yeah, you're dead. Gone. <laughs> Blasted. Tossed. She didn't even touch the blast, but she just vanished. Shocked. The OG Yeet right there. I'm saying, though. There you go. Great combo coming up from Tamim, but not going to be enough to kill off the top. So James finds respite, but, you know, has a lot of ground to make up here if he wants to, you know, get himself back uh, in the set and give himself a chance uh, to advance. Forward air is going to start coming out from Shoyo James, trying to take this to a game number four, trying to put himself on the board. So, Tamim, however, is in a very huge percentage lead, but that is Ness, and the back air will not connect. The air dodge going to come through for Shoyo James. Yeah, and a great punish on the other air dodge uh, from Tamim. Again, providing such great pressure right now, just going to witch time out of the, the PK fire. And, you know, witch, uh, witch time being an AOE uh, move, you know, it has to be very careful where James is when he gets hit by that. Uh, yeah, next trying to space out with those back airs. That long range of the back air, the back throw will come through for Shoyo James. Not going to be enough, not enough damage on him yet. Oh, had the right idea, but that up, which switch to the back air is going to connect. Oh, no, oh. bad air dodge, and that is going to be the way it ends, folks. A 3-0 uh, by EMG to meme on Shoyo James. And Shoyo James is going to fall out at, uh, I believe that's 13th place. Yep. Absolutely, but good stuff. Respectable placing a 13th place in the tournament. This stack is my nothing gas, to laugh at. My gas money, Tito. Like, my gas money. Not your gas money. That's unfortunate, but he will go back. He should go back feeling very, very confident for that bat, uh, for that car ride home, man, especially with Genesis on the on the horizon. Uh, 13th place at a tournament this stacked is something to be proud oh, yeah. of. I know, I know that obviously they're competitors and they want more, but 13th place, you have to understand, at this tournament, man, you got to be proud of that. We take those, man. So, nonetheless, uh, we are, I see Sinpai and Wadi walking up to the stage. I'm assuming Wadi is going to play. So, now we're getting into, I think, the qualifying section the top uh, eight. of top eight. So, so now Wadi, Ooh. I believe he lost to Tweak in, uh, he lost to Tweak in winner's quarters. So, 